Hi everyone, this is Kenneth from Gaze.com and today I'd like to show you the Communiverse, which is a nifty little interactive visual tool we've created here at Gaze.com to show you what your social universe really looks like. Let's start with my Communiverse, shall we? That guy you see in the middle there? That's me. On the top left corner of my avatar is a number which shows you how many friends I have here on Gaze.com. As it turns out, I've got 241 friends on the network. I can see who's online with the help of the online indicator, which is a little green dot on the top right hand corner that'll appear on someone's avatar when he's online. Now let me show all my 241 friends to you at once. Whoa, that's looking a little too cluttered for my liking and I can barely do anything with it. Besides, it's going to take forever before all my friends' avatars finish loading. So I'm going to filter them down with the control you see here on the bottom left corner of the screen. You can filter down your friends by the last login date, when they added you as a friend on the site, or by the degree of separation. That last option there is only useful when you're viewing someone else's friends, so let's filter my friends by their login date. Hmm, much better. Now, when you hover over any of your friends, your mutual friends will show up. Like this. See? This is a really cool way to see how your friends are all interconnected. Double click on any of your friends and they will show up in the middle with all their friends around them. Now clicking on my friend Nilsa's avatar shows me his name card, which allows me to do a couple of things. I can edit how we got to know each other, I can send him an inbox message, I could also send him a shout out, I can view all the pictures that he's uploaded before, and I can even recommend friends to him. Now let's browse through Nilsa's social network for a bit, shall we? There is Joshua, who I don't know, but he's a friend of my friend Nils, which makes him a second degree contact. And then there is Devin. As you browse further and further away from your own circle of friends, concentric circles will appear on the Communiverse to show you how many degrees of separation you're away from someone. As you can see now, these guys within this circle are second degree contacts, these guys are third degree contacts, and these guys fourth. Now as you browse through the Communiverse, all the people which you've clicked on before will show up on the right. Let's just say I've chanced upon someone I know from way back. How exciting! I can send him a friend request right here on the Communiverse by clicking on the very first button that appears on the left hand side of his name card. Anytime you want to get back to your own circle of friends, double click on your name card on the top right hand corner of the screen and voila, you're in the centre of your universe again. Last but not least, let me show you this toolbar on top which allows you to filter your friends by the countries they come from and by their current location. As you can see here, my friends are scattered across 64 cities in 25 countries around the world. Which reminds me, I'm flying to New York next week on a business trip, so let's see who I can meet up with while I'm there. As you can see, I've got 5 friends there, but I don't really have the time to meet all of them. So I'm gonna just set up a dinner date with Kelvin by sending him a message here. And hopefully I'll see everyone else at some club over the weekend. Fabulous! So that's all the time I have for you today and I'm off to pack my suitcase now. But if you really want to check this out and see how it all works, just log on to gaze.com, sign up for a free account and start inviting all your closest friends. See you!